Good evening. Prayers to move your mountains. And tonight's prayer is financial difficulties. And the scripture is in 2 Corinthians 9, 8. And, and it says, God is able to make all grace abound towards you, that you, always having all sufficiency in all things, may have an abundance for every good work. Lord, though you were rich, Lord Jesus, yet for my sake you became poor so that through your poverty I might become rich. I rejoice in knowing that you have spared no expense in sharing the riches of heaven with me. My sins are forgiven. I have the gift of eternal life, and I am seated in the heavenly places in Christ Jesus. In agreement with your word, I ask that you should supply all my financial needs according to your riches and glory by Christ Jesus. You are able to make all grace abound toward me that I always having all sufficiency in all things may have an abundance for every good work. Lord, you withhold no good thing from those who walk uprightly. Reveal to me any thoughts or actions that hinder the flow of your blessing. If I am living in disobedience, turn me around and bring me to repentance. If I have strayed from your will, direct me back to your path. If I lack the confidence to step out, Increase my faith. Godliness with contentment is great gain. Cleanse me of any greed, selfishness, or materialism that seeks to hoard your blessings rather than share them. I want to be a channel of your blessing, not merely a recipient. Bring to light any areas where I may be robbing you by withholding what rightfully belongs to you. When I bring the whole tide into the storehouse, you challenge me to test you and see if you will not throw open the floodgates of heaven and pour out so much blessing that I will not have enough room for it. Therefore, I will not withhold anything from you. Satan, you are a thief and you come only to kill, steal, and destroy. According to Matthew 18, 18, whatever I bind on earth will be bound in heaven and whatever I loose on earth will be loosed in heaven. So in the name of Jesus, I bind you from stealing from me and I command you to return what you have stolen. Financial roadblocks, I strike you down, and by the grace of Jesus Christ, I lose his, abundant, lose his abundant life. I place my trust, dear God, in your goodness. When I ask for bread, you will not give me a stone. When I ask for a fish, you will not give me a serpent. If I, in my sin-laden condition, know how to give good gifts, how much more will you give good gifts to those who ask you? How much more will you give good gifts to those who ask you? So hear my request and by your grace, lead me out of my financial straits and into your promised land of provision and abundance. Amen. So if you're having financial difficulties, I, I suggest you pray that prayer and really believe it. And uh, the Lord, he's a mighty God and he will supply your needs. So I'll be praying if you're having some difficulties. God bless you.